Allison, thanks so much. Well, residents of Elmwood Place worried about having enough police officers to keep them safe. They're absorb absorbing rather a new round of unsettling news that the man who had been leading the village's police department has now resigned. WLWT News 5's Todd Dykes is live tonight with the very latest. Todd, a lot of drama surrounding this for the last few weeks. You're right, Ashley, you know, and what may come as a surprise to some neighbors here in Elmwood Place may feel like it was inevitable to others. Uh, Kevin Kelsey did resign today as the village's interim police chief. Kelsey was named to that post back in April of this year, and during that time, he tells me, that he, he tells me rather, that he brought several officers on board and tried to get Elmwood's elected leaders to boost police pay and expand resources. Kelsey says the lack of action, action on those fronts is in part what prompted him to tell Vice Mayor Ronald Speer that he's accepted a position with another local department. I've met some wonderful people within the community. I made some um, new friends with hiring new officers, and uh, they're just incredible. But, you know, overall, in the eight months, we've done some good things, but I just feel like I've met repeated um, obstacles and opposition from the elected officials. It's true. Officers aren't paid enough. Uh, the, the loss of industry. Yeah has affected our village more than some. And we're trying to do our best to try and get industry in here, uh, get businesses in here that's gonna help us bring back revenue so that we can afford to pay our officers and our all of our departments more. Now, Kevin Kelsey says he and a part-time officer resigned this afternoon, leaving Elmwood Place with a police lieutenant and another part-time officer to patrol the streets and keep an eye on things and help with court services. Vice Mayor Ronald Spears uh, telling me the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office is helping uh, with resources and the village is in talk with St. Bernard to provide additional coverage. Reporting live tonight, Todd Dykes, WLWT News 5. Now, Todd, we have been reporting on issues involving the police department in Elmwood Place for some time now. Any idea why the interim chief resigned today? Well, actually, it seems like the tipping point may have happened last week. Uh, Kelsey says that's when he heard about a, a village council meeting that he was not of, aware of, not informed of. And during that meeting, there may have been some discussion about the future of the police department. That coupled with Kelsey's call and hope that local, state, and even federal authorities uh, come here to Elmwood Place to examine what's happening on the ground, all that put together is what led to today's resignation. Ashley? Todd Dykes reporting live for us on this story. Thanks so much, Todd. And this all comes after a deadly shoot.